Hi there, welcome to Be A Surface Pro. Today's Surface Pro tip is using multiple desktops, the updated edition. Multiple or virtual desktops have been built into Windows 10 since the beginning. And you can access them by clicking on the task view button or pressing Windows and Tab on your keyboard or swiping in from the left hand edge of your screen. In the task view, with the latest update of Windows 10, you'll see a button at the top of the screen that says New Desktop. Click on it to create your second virtual desktop. You can then click on that virtual desktop to open up applications and start working in that virtual space. To switch back to your first desktop, just go back to the task view and you'll be able to toggle back to desktop one or two. You can create as many virtual desktops as you want in Windows 10. Now virtual desktops or multiple desktops are a way of separating applications visually from each other. So for example, I will often have perhaps my video scripts and to-do lists in OneNote on one virtual desktop. And across in another virtual desktop, I might have my email and task list. I use those multiple desktops to help me to focus on one task at a time and to reduce the lag time that's associated with switching tasks. So when I do need to switch tasks, when I do get interrupted, I can switch over and see a setup of Windows that's perfectly set up for me to focus and get the information I need. And then when I switch back to my original desktop, I don't have to rearrange Windows and reopen programs to get back to where I was. There's also some keyboard and trackpad shortcuts that you can use to navigate your multiple desktops. Use the control, windows, and left or right keys to toggle between your multiple desktops in the order that they're open. If you're using your trackpad on your Surface keyboard, place four fingers on your trackpad and swipe left or right to move between multiple desktops. And one extra shortcut for you is control, windows, and D on the keyboard is a quick and easy way to create a new virtual desktop. Virtual desktops are a little bit of a tricky concept to understand at first, but once you do understand them, you can embrace them to help you to be a bit more productive. Tell us about how you use multiple desktops in the comments below. And if you found this tip helpful, remember to give us the thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Surface Pro tips.